Hey everyone, it's Ellen from Rhapsody Music Lessons. And earlier today, I was working with a student who is in the Bastion Piano Basics book, level two. And we just started a new piece called In the Ocean Deep, and that can be found on page 15. This song has a ton of staccato in the right hand. Staccato is uh, instead of like this, you would play it short and kind of kind of a choppy sound. The bottom is very smooth. I just did a piece where the left hand was playing melody and that was out of an adult book. Well, this is the same thing. This, in this particular book, the left hand is playing your melody, right hand's playing the chords. The first time through, you go to ending one. And that's what this means. When you see this in music, a one and then a two, you play it through, ending one, then you go back and you repeat it and you play it through and you skip ending one and you go right to ending two. Boom, double bar line, that means you're done, you end it. So I will play this for my student Zara and for anyone else who is working on this particular song in the ocean deep out of the Bastion book, um, I hope this helps you as well. I will slow it down. It's a little bit tricky. You're also using intervals of sevenths. That is almost a whole octave. Um, from C to B, you're skipping one, two, three, four, five white keys. When you skip five white keys in between your fingers, you're playing a seventh. That's a pretty good stretch, especially for some of my students with little hands. If I just went one more key up, I'm going from C to C, that's an octave. Okay, that's about, and I've been playing for a long time, but I'm I'm not much more comfortable with I'm not comfortable with anything beyond an octave. I never have been. So anyway, this is sevenths, and that's a pretty good stretch. Okay, so we're starting way down low on this G, and we're starting up here on this G. So this is the middle C. We're going this G is where your right hand thumb is starting, and then from middle C way down. So you're skipping this C and you're going down to this G to start your melody. Okay. That's that. I hope that that helps anybody who's working on this song. Uh, my fingering was not perfect in this, but that is how it goes. And again, it's in the ocean deep. Bastion Piano Basics Level 2, page 15. Thanks for watching. Have a great one. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.